every year for the next three to five years. It is a staggering number. Every 25 seconds, an American has a heart attack. It can happen any time, any place. Technology is making it easier to predict who is at risk. Dr. Joe's going to show us how it might save your life. cookie, no crystal ball. Heart attacks often strike suddenly and without warning. I had no sign of chest pain. But Ray Bafuz did get that warning thanks to a new blood test. This particular test allows us to identify people at an extremely early stage. They've got plenty of time to correct it. The test predicted Ray had an almost 50% chance of having a heart attack in the next five years. It's extremely powerful at predicting who's not at risk. It's also extremely powerful at identifying people who need further workup. The test is called PULSE, short for Protein Unstable Lesion Signature. A lot of tests. Dr. Douglas Harris says it measures traces of proteins that leak out of soft fatty plaques lurking inside blood vessel walls like a pimple ready to burst. We'd like to be able to identify those people who get a clean bill of health. They walk out the door and they drop dead of a heart attack and everybody scratches their head and says, well, why did that happen? Blood tests play a role, but Tampa cardiologist Dr. Eric Harrison says seeing is believing. This is a, a patient, 48 years old. He's uh, basically a soldier and a special forces gentleman. Harrison uses color-coded heart CAT scans to see inside his patient's heart. That's where you worry? I call this the fried green egg with ketchup. The green is the inside of the vessel where the blood flows. That red color is the gooey plaque. Stretch it out, this hourglass shape shows the patient that former military man is in trouble. It's the first time that I told someone that I think you're going to have a heart attack. What he didn't know is how quickly it would happen. So that was a matter of days after this test was so done? This is 12 days after the test and four days after I gave him the prescriptions and talked to him. Again, Dr. Charles Taylor is taking to a new level. The ability to be able to look inside the coronary arteries and to get high resolution images of the coronary arteries is, is a truly a game changer. This former aviation engineer is applying aerodynamic equations to predict blood flow in the human body. We combine information about the anatomy of the, of the heart and we look at the size of vessels. The software then color codes vessels that don't have enough blood. And the areas that are red show that the pressure um, supplying blood to the tissue is lower than than it should be. That information can be used by physicians to decide whether the patient should be treated with medicine or lifestyle modification or they would really benefit from a stent, from a coronary stent or surgery. And while all these tests are still finding their place in cardiac medicine, Ray says he's a believer. Turns out his artery was completely blocked. Oh, I'm shocked. Ray got a stent, a fix, and a healthier future thanks to a look at the cardiac crystal ball. I'm Dr. Joette Chiavinko, Fox 13 News. The Paul's blood test is sometimes covered by insurance, but many of these other new tests may be out of pocket. Dr. Joe's put links and lots more information on our website. Go to myfoxtampabay.com.